Hey guys, welcome back to the BMW Block channel. We just had a chance to see the new M3 G80 in the Isle of Man green color. The uh, rear wheel drive six speed manual non competition model. And as another surprise today, we do have the G82 M4 in Sao Paulo yellow. Also, the non competition model rear wheel drive six speed manual. It's actually the first time that we get to see the two cars in the non competition spec. But while the uh, M3, it's in uh, the stock configuration, the M4 did receive some of the uh, visual upgrades specific to competition models. So, at the front, you have the carbon fiber package with the large air intakes. And naturally, you're still getting the same large kidney grill. And we'll try to find another angle to look at. It is quite large, there is no way around that, um, but it does not look as wide, as tall as it does in some of the press photos and some of the videos that we've seen before. I truly believe that um, in real life um, it fits the car characters a little bit better than you've seen in the photos. It matches the design of the M3 and M4 better than on the 4 Series because it's a little bit bolder, more muscular, so it blends in. I also believe that it will look best with some dark colors like the uh, frozen black or black sapphire, even tanzanite blue. So that's an option if you like to hide a little bit more. Look at the new lights as well. You can see the nicely sculpted uh, hood which is unique to the M3 and M4. Move to the side. A three-quarter view of the car. So you can see it's quite aggressive, quite dynamic. I do love the uh, character lines running across the side. Uh, you, you are getting the uh, carbon fiber mirrors here. The mirror caps in carbon fiber with a new design as well. M3 logo on the side gill. If you move to the wheels, a new wheels design with the uh, optional carbon ceramic brakes and yellow calipers. Michelin PS4S tires on these two cars. See the side view as well. You see that character line running across the car. It's a little bit different than um, previous designs. But the idea behind that is to actually emphasize the sportiness of the car and also to give it a different look under different light conditions. Typical L-shaped taillights. Also a bit larger than usual. They wrap around the trunk and the fenders as well. Quite muscular and uh, uh, wide from the back, so that's always a plus on any M car. You can see this three quarter view as well. So, overall, from the rear, it's a spectacular design. Of course, the front is controversial and it's also very subjective, so you either like it or hate it. Because it has the carbon fiber package, you're also getting a carbon fiber diffuser integrated with the quad exhaust pipes. And carbon fiber trunk spoiler. So once again, non-competition, 473 horsepower, 480 around there. And the six-speed manual real wheel drive configuration. Let's take a look inside as well. Two-tone leather combination. I believe this is called Fjord Blue. And with Sao Paulo Yellow in the suede material. You're also getting suede on the side bolsters as well. 
double stitching in Sao Paulo yellow, perforated leather, M4 illuminated sign, and optional carbon fiber seats. You can see them up close here. We will get to drive the car today, so I can share more about that in the next video. Sport steering with the carbon fiber inserts, the M1 and M2 configurable buttons, and of course the six speed manual. Alright guys, so once again, this is the all new M4, if you like to see the M3 video, just uh, click the link in the description below or up in the corner. As always, thanks for watching, please do not forget to subscribe to our channel, hit the notification bell, and stay tuned for some exhaust sound videos with the new M3 and M4, and also with the previous generations M3 and M4. Thanks for watching.